Alright, what is up guys? It's the Lax Player 58 here and um I have a team update and I ordered some stuff from lacrossemonkey.com this morning. This is not an unboxing. The unboxing will probably be tomorrow because it's not in the mail yet, but I ordered it today. Um and I also uh I I have a couple teams that I'm on now. I made this team called 395 Stars Lacrosse. It's out of Temecula, Fallbrook, and Valley Center area, and it um, it's its second season. Last year was the inaugural season, and I didn't play. I, I did not play for them last year. Um, it it if for those of you who don't know where Temecula, Fallbrook, Valley Center area is, it's um, kind of northern of San Diego. It's probably couple hours north. Uh, and so, it's a good organization so far. I've had a few practices. Seems really cool. We're going to be getting some pennies, shooting shirts, shorts, and socks. And those will be coming at various times throughout the month. Probably between tomorrow and the next couple weeks. Because they're all coming at different times. So we're getting custom adrenaline socks. We're getting the, I forgot what they're called, but they're, I think, I believe, they are the most high-end athletic shorts that Nike makes, custom. We're getting dry-fit shooting shirts, and I do not know what kind of pennies we're getting. And so, that is going to be pretty cool. That's throughout the whole summer, and then this, this, let's see, what's... It's going to be about next month, July 13th, 14th, and 15th. I'm playing in a tournament called the Sun Smash Tournament for a U15 team called the Arizona Misfits. Um, I've never heard of them. I was asked to play, and uh, sounds fun, so I did it. It only cost $35 to me. Um, it's at Great. It's run by Great Western Lacrosse. It's at San Diego State University. You can come out and check it out if you're playing it. Good job. Good luck. Maybe you're on my team. Who knows? Um, now, I also ordered some stuff from Lacrosse Monkey, but it's not an unboxing. That's going to be tomorrow. Today, I'm just telling you because I wanted to make a team update. Um, so, I ordered a shaft and some new elbow pads. I ordered a shaft because... What I want to do, I'm not telling you what shaft, but I'm going to give a hint here. I want to unstring my stallion and string it with a gold and black pita pocket. That's your hint, so if you want to try to guess what it is before tomorrow when the unboxing will most likely be, um, do it. So now I order new elbow pads because these, my old King 2's, that are not very good, that I don't even barely use anymore, have begun to tear. If you can see through there, watch this. Okay, that little hole right there. Stick my fingers through, and boom, tear. Maybe if I put it right here, you could see in there there's a tear. Yeah, you probably could not see that because of the lighting. But there's a tear right where the elbow goes. This is my right. Actually, this is my left arm guard. And it is not comfy. Do not like it. It's tearing. Don't like it. And I cross these things because these are huge. And I don't even... I got these when I played attack. That was when I was still figuring out what a good position was. And I, and I played attack most last season. And I got these... No. D I mean, they're like 35 bucks. They were like 95 when they came out. But they're like $35. They're not that good. They are popular. see them a lot, probably because they're so cheap now. Um, yeah. So, eh. For beginners, maybe recommended at this day and age how they are priced. Um, for a more intermediate to advanced player, I'd reckon I recommend... An arm guard such as the um, Cell 2, uh, Jolt maybe, possibly for an intermediate, beginning to intermediate player. 
and then for those higher players, more advanced, uh, K18 and Assault, if you may or may not know, depending on some of my other videos, if you've noticed, um, I love STX, it's like my favorite company. This is the only, the only thing that I don't have STX is my helmet and both my shafts. I have a Maverick Wonder Boy and a Brine Swizzbeat 2010. Or 2011, not sure. So, yeah, but I ordered an STX shaft, guess. Um, and I'll be making a video of that tomorrow. And I'll also be doing a review on my new elbow pad soon. So stay tuned for that, and comment, rate, subscribe, and I'm out.